Hi, I'm Barry Gardner from LNS Chip Blaster. Today we're going to talk about what to do if you got a new chip blaster or you just change your coolant and you want to start off fresh on a high pressure coolant system. Okay, so what we're going to do is you're going to remove the cap. You're going to grab your coolant hose, your bucket and a funnel, however you want. You're going to fill this up with your coolant. You're going to see it come up in the clear hose. Once it maintains its height about up here, the pump head is now full. And then you just put the cap back on. Tighten her up, make sure there's no air. So once we got the transfer pump primed, now it's time to air purge the high pressure pump. So you want to go to the HMI, you want to go to maintenance, jog air purge again, and then hold air purge side A for about 30 seconds or so, let it go, do it again about 30 seconds or so, let it go. All right, so while you're air purging, you're not gonna really see any difference, but you're gonna hear it. So you're gonna hear the coolant going through the pump and the pump's gonna change sound. So once that's done, then you wanna go to your machine tool, call your high pressure coolant M code, see if there's anything coming out. If there is not, then you're gonna go back and you're gonna redo that process again. 